<laughs> you know, like that type of stuff. Bitch, you nasty. <laughs> you better. What's up, y'all? Welcome back with another channel. And um, as y'all can see, I have my girl, Kid, it's your boy Candy, with me again. Hey, y'all, it's your boy Candy, and um, what's up, Facebook, YouTube, all that? All that. So, as you can see, we back again, whatever. We, as y'all can see, we giving a very lazy, trading set. Like, I ain't got my nails on. We both giving bonnets. Um, we was partying all night last night. I thought maybe we should be maybe a little more comfortable in this video. It wasn't about being comfortable. I just wasn't putting on nothing else. So, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so but um, we yeah. we pretty much just gonna catch up with each other, whatever. If, you, if this is on my page, cause we gotta make sure we don't. If, yeah, if this is on my page, y'all go fuck with her, follow her, subscribe, like, etc. And on everything, it's your boy with Candy, right? Everything, yeah, everything. Uh, Facebook is it's your boy Candy. Um, Instagram. It's your boy Candy. All that. Uh, and then you can just type in J Will. You got a Candy. Snapchat too? No. I can't keep up with all this. Oh, God. You got to get into the live. Uh, who's Twitter? Like, yeah, I'm building it. <laughs> I got a little TikTok too. It's just a I, lot I, I, I'm, I'm trying to get into TikTok though. You need to. That's the new thing. Yeah, a lot of kids are asking, are you on TikTok? I'm like, girl, what? Comment below if y'all like TikTok. Then you should get into it. Um, I'm starving. You said Grace? Yeah. yeah I always pray. Oh, oh. <laughs> I thought he was going to pray. Okay. okay. Um, amen. Thank you. <laughs> okay. All right. I can deal with that. Okay. All right. What's duck sauce? Duck sauce. Don't. Oh, well, I'm sorry. What we have here, y'all, is um, what is this? I've got these right I don't know what she brought over here. But we're going to do some, like, <laughs> this is Chinese. Ass, ass right. Some That's Chinese, what whatever. So we just, we got to get rid of it. But, um, yeah. And then we got cake. And we got a little dessert. You oh my God. You got me the... Uh, but, you match, but you matching though, right? And I'm matching. Oh, right. You know, it's crazy. That's crazy. Oh, <laughs> you match it. I don't know. I'm going to try the sauce. I always need a little hot sauce or something. Yeah, hot. Let me add some of this on there. They said this is so bad for you. I don't you. know what it is. It is bad for you. What is bad? But the, this, this, this is... Um, soy sauce. Soy sauce. They say Why soy is sauce bad you? I guess because there's a lot of sugar in it or whatever, I think. Or a lot of soy in it. But that sauce is good though. I'm surprised I'm even eating eating Japanese or Chinese because I don't even eat. But after that, I have to give myself a chance. Look, I went downstairs and I grabbed some extra Taco Bell packets. It this just, is too creative for me. Right, it's just one of those days. It's one of so, those days. Um, and we have a pork. I don't know where the pork at. So, in the rest of the catching, so uh, I'm on Taco Bell Chinese <laughs> food right now because I can't do them sauces. What? What's mm -hmm. tea? So, in the words of catching up, what's been going on? Uh, I know yesterday you did the Queen Queen Supreme Court. The Queen Supreme, Supreme Court. Court. Yes, with Madison. Yes, that was amazing. Yeah. Um. um yeah, that aired today because I know we about to drop this video. That airs later today, y'all. Mm -hmm. Make sure y'all tune in. Um, to Maddie. That. I think it was a great. Um, it was everything. You know? Yeah, I was. I, I I ended up being a little more. Um, I guess personal or vulnerable, you would say. Mm -hmm. Didn't expect Which it. Which was good, though. Yeah, everybody loved it. Because it also so. shows that side. Everybody wanted to see that vulnerable side. So I, I feel like it was a great thing. And I know my fans are going to love it because, you know, I want to know what's been going on. So I was Yeah, and I, I'm excited about this new song that's about to come out that you oh introduced me God, to. Yeah. I mean, all jokes aside, like, I, I said, thank you. Genuinely. That's not even a candy song. It's a Jay Will song, to be honest. Okay, so Jay Will, yeah. I actually love that song, though. You know, I know you asked me so many times, but. My my pen's already my pen. I love it, and that's just what it is. It's called Hello. Yeah. So it's a lot of emotion in it. Like it's very vulnerable. Yes, very sad. So that's why. I'm, but you know, I, I'm into very vulnerable songs and stuff like that. Even though I've never been in love or in a relationship, but it's like, no, I never been in love or or in a relationship. And then my life, never. At all. I don't mean to get into that, but, but I don't. yeah, we can get into it. You is so you a cool bitch. I know. Um, well, at the time where, when I was Marcus, you know, I was into the stage of trying to find myself, you know, uh, growing, you know, just trying to figure out my gay life, whatever, mm. you know. And then 
Cause growing up as a kid, you know, being picked on, you're insecure and all that. You know, I, I, got, I was bullied. I was bad. I dealt with that too. You know, so I had eggs thrown at me and I was spit on and people kicked me and stuff like that. So oh. you, you kind of lose yourself. And you like, you you don't think you're pretty or, you know. Worthy of even putting yourself in a position to kiki with anybody. Right. Like and then when somebody, do try to you, when somebody do tell you that you're beautiful or whatever, you you don't feel it. You don't feel yourself because you like, you're saying it just, you're just trying to be nice. Mm. And they can actually really mean that. Like, no, you really are beautiful. And yeah, I had to learn myself in order for you to allow someone to love you, you got to love you first. Mm -hmm. Because no matter what, if they give love, you sometimes don't even know how to receive it. Mm -hmm. So, if you're not used to it, that was like mm. that was like a, a, a real thing. But I don't know why I haven't I have been in love like any other average um, teenager grow up with being in love. I don't know. I just feel like maybe I ain't really put myself out there as much as you know, or maybe I haven't attracted that yet, or you know, because it just it just hasn't really came away. Now, uh, I I'll be honest, I've tracked a lot of fuck boys. We fuck, we leave them by. You know, that's it. Um, I don't know. Maybe I, I mean I, I've tried to be in to keep what's on a different level. Yeah, but it's never just it never went so far. It's like I'm I'm being stood up. You know, people don't say what they mean. Just they yeah, like geez. once they hear the word that you're gay, they're like, oh, you want to fuck? And they people think gay is sex. Gay is not always mean yeah. sex. It doesn't mean like that. You know I'm picking the peas off of y'all, wondering what I'm doing. I did not like peas. <laughs> and then it's the rice is cool, but the broccoli, I'm like. Did so, they see it? Right. I told you that race was nasty. No. Oh my God. So wow. Okay. I could see how you were, you know. Yeah. So I'm just going to be such a great person. I mean, but, this is the I've ever talked about this. I never really talk about like my, my inside. Feeling. You know. I mean, I, I feel like I, 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 can, I can talk better when I'm talking with somebody because I can explain myself. Likewise. I like talking about myself with somebody. Right, you know? too. Cause you can bounce off energies. Always good to have a energy yeah. Off of. You know, like right now, I do feel the emotion inside. Like I, I can cry right now because I'm talking about myself and things that I've been through or whatever, and why I haven't had fallen in love. Or you know, and don't get me wrong. Like just because I'm in spirit, I, I, I may have like a humble. I do have days where I be like, damn, why ain't I have anybody? You know, I do. I you want to, more? Or? Yeah, you know. I had those days too. Like I, 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 I want to like, fuck this damn Instagram. You know I man? want affection. And stuff People like that. will be like, oh, oh, where's this? Where's this? Where that? Hey, bitch, let me take a moment with myself and do for me, so I can get when some days you'll wake up. Like you want to keep key with somebody. Like I haven't done no video. I haven't done no videos lately on Instagram because I just feel like I've just been taking a day with myself. You have to. I have. I really have. You like, have what to. the videos that? What the videos that? I just been taking a day with myself. You know, I, I've been trying to learn more about me. How long have you been doing this? It's been about it's four and four years for me now. Because I know you probably, when you was, you was out there probably a little earlier than me, like a mm -hmm. few months, two so years. It's going on like. I, I started in 2016. Me too, but you know, mine was a, a grow type of thing, mm -hmm. like J. Will and Candy. So, it's, so we got on the same page. After a while, I was like, when you get a lot of buzz and hype and stuff, mm -hmm. for, not to be wrong, but so for things that people see is so like great. Which it is, because we're unique and whatever. Right. But when this is kind of you, camera on, camera off, you know, there's some days where you'll just wake up not feeling the, ooh, I'm, like, yeah. I'm lean, and I, or, and I, ooh, I'm candy. You like, bitch, like. And people think it's easy, because, like, I don't, I don't get up like that. I be like, right. yeah, what I'm going to do today? I'm going to grow. You know? I'll figure it out. And I have my managers, and I was like, look, it's, hey, you got to get video up today. Video up today. I be like, okay, I'm going to do today, and I don't even do it. I just say it just like brush them off my shoulders. But that's what I be struggling. You gotta appreciate them. Because I be wishing some days I had somebody that be like, hey, bitch, by the way, you need that. Because me, my mind race so bad to where, like, you know how you're always up in your feelings? I can tell you, like, I, I, I can tell your mind is like here and there. Like, you're, because there's so much going on, I thought that you struggle with, you know, and, and trying to balance everything. Like, I, I don't know, I, I feel that vulnerableness from you. Like, I, I feel that from you. Because it's like, hey, my, 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 my boy's in here just, Trying to juggle everything by itself, and but I always say it's, it's going to really pay off for you, and it really is. It's going to show a lot. I mean, and when I say it's going to show, it's going to show so good because a lot of people going to be trying to fuck with you that was didn't want, who, who want to fuck with you, but shady. Hey, me does does. I got a lot of does. I think what's being Kenny going is um no. What is that? What I've had to learn. And we keep talking about mm -hmm. we're really trying to leave you out, but we here. Right, we're we here. friends in real life. Right. But, um, 
I think God recently had to tell me, like, to, to teach me a lesson. Mm-hmm. You, got, you, you can't bite off more than you can chew. Yeah. There's been a lot of situations, friendships, obligations that really probably don't benefit directly why God placed me on this earth. Yeah, but, it's a plane, it's a plane, but it's okay. <laughs> um, can you close the window, please? Yeah, can I use your Yeah, can I do that after, if that's okay? Yeah. Yeah, right. Um, no, yeah, no worries. Um, like I was saying, I, I recently had to learn, like, you know, you got to do what's best for you mm -hmm. and not take on the obligations. Sometimes you want to make other people so damn happy and then you'll wake up and yeah. you got 10, 5, 3 things to do that's taking away from, like, what if I woke up and I was just selfish? Like, what is going to benefit me directly? Mm -hmm. Versus, oh, yeah, oh, you need me to pick you up. Oh, you need me to do what? Or, uh, I'll do this because I care. Like, uh, -uh. Yeah, I almost kind of feel like today's motivation word I sent to that today. It did? Oh, duh. Yeah, you send them every day. Yeah. Uh... Chris, go to yours. Can you read yours, please? Read my one. If you go to your sentence, I just put it on. Can you read today's to motivation word? Today's motivation word? We can read it from, read from his phone. So today's mo- Um. You don't like that broccoli, huh? No, you go to the Wi-Fi. This broccoli is disgusting. Dry, unseasoned. The but you okay. like your food unseasoned, so you say. And go to go to your messages. I need go to my message. Spark in it. Yeah, Lord, it's a Lord. I say unseasoned, unseasoned. Go to your um message. Okay. I said. So every morning, y'all, uh -huh. before, before we talk about every morning, every fucking morning, I send all my friends. Um, just wish I send all my friends. Um, <laughs> good morning quotes. You know. And she know how bad of a text I am. She still send them. That's why I appreciate them. <laughs> And even those who don't respond back, I still send them back because it's like everybody needs some type of word for, you know, um, like when they go through something, just they need some type of word. When they, when motivation, they uh, motivation, something, yes, something, something to give me up. So today's motivation would read this out loud. When you do good, you get good. Fulfillment comes from serving others. That's Christopher. Go ahead. Not just hustling to serve yourself. On a path to success. There's always going to be an opportunity to help someone else to be successful too. Take that opportunity and be kind of the person who makes a difference in the lives of others. That person can always get overlooked. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Christopher. Mm -hmm. So that person can always get overlooked. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's Christopher. <laughs> I give a shout out. Christopher always, always would be. He's like yeah. world's, my, world's my, best driver, best security guard. All that. Don't mm -hmm. grab Lynn because I'll punch you in the fucking face if you grab her. I met Christopher through. Yeah, that, well, that's a whole other video we're talking about, but I met Christopher. I'll tell you about that. A whole new, a whole other video. That's like a story time. Yeah. Um, but yeah, like I, I have, I have, you know, like I said, I have, I have a manager, my PO, I have Christopher. You I have like, that PO? Huh? Probation officer. Oh, that's <laughs> wrong. <laughs> <That's all. laughs> you put on your PM No, I, I need my PR. I have my PR. I have my PR and Christopher, my manager, so it's like I have help. I and that and that help allow me to juggle. I what I, it, boom. Yeah, what I have what I have going on. I don't have a uh, PO, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Good. Do some research on your team. Yeah. Uh, that slipped out all the way. <laughs> But yeah, um, but yeah, so I have, I have a lot of help and, I, and it does help me to juggle what I have to do because all I, all I really have to do is just make a video and why everybody else help me, you know, get here, get there mm. or what I got to do, you know. So and when I come down here, Chris will be, he'll be on me like, all right, get up, let's go do this, let's go do that, you know, let's, let's make these moves, let's no, get up. you need that. So even though I was like, okay, like, I don't want to do this, you know, I, well, we came down here for a reason because, you know, he keeps me going, whatever, you know, so. Regardless how I cut him out, whatever, don't want to do this, but he's like, girl, I want to hear all that. Come on. We still got shit to do. Come on, baby. So I do, I really do appreciate him a lot for that because I have you my You need day. that. You need that. Yeah. You need that. You need that. You definitely need that. So. For a while, I was looking for that, but it always set me back. Mm hmm I didn't tell myself that God is going to allow that to come for me. Mm hmm when it's time, because I, you know, find myself a lot, you know, trying to force people to care about things they don't want really to care about, because ultimately we need help, you know, mm -hmm. so I just, I try to take people who was around, like, oh, do this and that, and it just kind of always would end a little sour. Right. So this year, it's like really the year of me 
kind of getting back, taking it back to the basics of how I kind of got popping in the first place. Like, I right. used to do the hair, the nails, the makeup. It's like Which I'm going to start going back to my old ways. In yeah, it's, all, it's really all the old ways because I got popping while I was working another job. But I was so determined because I was working a full-time job at Olive Garden. But then I'd get off and mm -hmm. I'd do videos all night because I was so determined and so motivated and excited. You know, but then things can kind of get a little challenging. You could get a little comfortable. Right. And if I'm like, oh, I need so much help. And it's down my bitch. Get up. How you used to get up. So that's what I'm really trying to reprogram myself to get back and do it. And I wouldn't have kept my same routine when I first started blowing up. Like, just kept doing hair, 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 and, you know, makeup. Because it was really booming a lot. I was getting a lot of views. Mm -hmm. And I started doing other stuff. Doors kept opening for other things. I started getting wigs. You know, I started doing other things. I got more upgraded of myself. I mean, because you're all allowed to be upgraded of yourself. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know? So I slowed down doing 27 pieces, not realizing this is what made me. That was your key. That was my key. That's what got me in the door. That's your biggest key. So, I love you with the 27 like, I don't even really want to see you with hair hair. Because so, the 27 it be, and you be rocking them, bitch. Yeah. And, I, and that's what people really love me for. So I think I'm going to go back to my, my roots where I really started. And that's what made me. I me, mean, I feel like I kept what I started. It's just like you said, some other opportunities, huh? Oh, mm -hmm. my God. It's a lash. Oh, my. That's what made me do it. You know, so, the lash itch. Oh. Right. Um, I think for me, what it was is um, so much came at once. Mm -hmm. I aired on two shows in one week, and with that came a lot. Like, mm -hmm. one week you go into the grocery store, and it's fine. The next week, it's like you're being ambushed, which is totally fine. But it's just, you know, right. again, being by myself, having a process all that. Mm -hmm. I think where I kind of shifted was, you know, I, I focused on bigger opportunities, mm -hmm. which were great. It helped me first even more so. Uh -huh. But, you know, as a brand and as an artist, you always have to, you know, you can do all these other things. Mm -hmm. But you always have to make sure no matter what, when those things are done, this is still moving. And I feel like I kind of just neglected this for these. Right. You know, and then come to find out these don't even really... Go together. Then, you know, they just, you know, when you find out the truth, this business, it's like, oh, bitch, I could have... Stay my ass in content. Like. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a little, it's a little, you know, a lesson. I like all these things that we go through, even though people don't know what we'll, we'll go behind the, behind the scenes. Because I don't post none of I don't like seeing them bitter and others. I don't post that type it's, of shit. It's a lie. Like, it's it's work. I mean, I, I love working. I love working. But, but boom. It's like work, work, work. <sighs> yeah, how much work I got to do? Now, bitch, you know, I got to really. But no, we love it, so that's why we do. And it's, it's, it's a blessing because. People come to us for opportunities. They're like, hey, we want, we want you. We want to work with you. We like, we, we do, you know. So that's that's a, the, the thing about social media. I like. You gotta weed through those. Everybody who's saying, hey, let me help you, is not meant to help. Huh? And I and I, I know that too as well. I wish you know? I wish you a good amount of time with a fuck nigga. People say they want to help you, but but they really just want to ride your wave and make some corn off of you and get, get rid of you. Like that boy, hide your kids, hide your wife, hide. You know they got his ass. You know. What happened, man? Um, he moved to L.A. and, you know, he was getting bookings and something like that, but he wasn't getting no money. No, they made all that money off of him from that song. Uh-huh. They were, they were robbing him blind. <clears throat> is, that, is that like an L.A. thing or something? <clears throat> Don't kill me, Adam. But I was just, my, my, my friend's from L.A., so. Compton. Compton. What's the difference? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's try a cake, though. Friend, you're going to have to taste this shit next time you bring this. You had to kind of taste it to make sure. This was a little kiki. This is a capful. Right. Let's try this cake though. The next time you have to make sure that rice is hidden. Okay. It was cool. It's not the job done I was starting. <laughs> well, next time, I want to go to Benihana's or something. Yeah. This was like a little little rush job, but, you know. That's not too much. Mmm. Oh, my God. You got another, um. I think you report damn. Bitch, no. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. We'll see up here. So, I do want to say to y'all, I know y'all see Bonnie and stuff. I am coming out with Bonnix this year. Yes, I'm getting my website together this year. Okay. Um, so I, I am coming out. Some. Yeah, oh definitely. The Bonnets are coming out this year, official. Um, just working on it's a lot of work. I just can't tell y'all too much what I'm doing, but they are coming out this year, the Bonnets, whatever. So mm -hmm. I'm excited about that. They might be asking me, hey, where did you get your body at? And I'm like, if I wear them so much, you just wait a minute. I'm going to sell them, honey, okay? I'm going to sell them. Hey, y'all want to get the earrings from Canada? You said buy them too? Mm -hmm. That's, that's my press on. That I don't have them right now. Okay. Now, them, no, I don't know. I was always fascinated with those nails. Mm -hmm. Because I'm like, who is a girl? 
with these long ass nails. No, yeah, I remember. Um, and like the first video I saw you, like I said, it was, it was a headline. You was like, you damn. If this is like an Asian interview, you like the bottom. Like an Asian interview, you ain't like nobody but bottom. <laughs> Hi, Bobby. <laughs> Bobby Brown. Bobby Christina. Mm -hmm. If a bitch walking AG in, she walking out, that's a vibe. I was like, hey, me and my bitches, me and my bitches, where we from? AG is ain't nothing but a motherfucking pop. <laughs> that video oh, is a key key for me. And that bitch was like, uh, yeah, it's gonna be niggas and niggas and niggas galore. Clap me to Miguel. Not Tabra. Yeah, Miguel, not Tabra. And you actually got up on the covers and everything, like, Hello. <laughs> you know how it is when you try to, you try to call off in your accent? That's a true story. It is. I'm like, you actually got up under the covers. I'm like, he I mean, put, put the bonnet on. Yeah. <laughs> that was a key. Baby girl was not prayer. No, it was definitely a key. And speaking about other girl, yeah, I just wasn't consistent with a lot of things I started with back then, and that's kind of what we talking about. Sometimes it ain't what's new, what's right. next. No, the bitch, when you that bitch, just keep being that bitch again and again and again. So, uh, tune into my video with y'all because my room is a mess. So, um, anything else you want to share before we? Don't you gotta get back on this road? I do like it on the road, y'all. I do it on the road because it is getting late. I can see outside it's getting late, whatever. And yeah, so probably about to be like, yeah, you know, yeah. I gotta go home and do it, you know, clean this hole, all that and stuff, because there's a lot of shit up in here. <laughs> you know, like, that type of stuff. Bitch, you nasty. <laughs> you better hope I don't smell it. Bye. <laughs> Cut this shit off. Cut it. Go. Bye. Bye. <laughs>